Hi everyone, I am Rishav and in this video, I would show you that how you can set up React.js framework in your local machine or PC or laptop so that you can start your web development journey with this framework like if you bas know basic of HTML CSS so you can start with React.js framework I would uh, show you all the things like how to set up the whole process how you can uh, run it on your local machine and all these things with Node.js and the code editor will be VS Code right so let's just begin without wasting any time and this will be a series like I would be uh, posting videos about React.js and all the stuffs so there are also videos about github so android development so if you like my contents your work is to do subscribe my channel and click the bell notification so that you never miss out my videos whenever they are posted right so subscribe the channel click on the bell notification hit the like button if you like this video right so let's just begin with our work that is to setting up of our react js So first thing for react.js open any of your browser search for node.js so first we will download and install node.js then our code editor and then setting up our react.js so you have to search here node.js the first one that is the node.js official so that is official go for that one node.js now there is a current version latest features but uh, i will use 16 point this one so click on this one it will download this one msi this one so it will download it is 26.7 mb so let's just download this one and after that i will install the node.js on my pc the next thing after the node.js that we have is vs code so go in your chrome browser and, and search for vs code the first one code.visualstudio.com that one official one go for that one and once it is done download the one which is your device like if you're having mac then download the mac version if you're having windows then download the windows version 64 bit 62 bit any of them so click on download and it will start downloading all the things right it will download all the things uh, zip folder will come so i uh, i am not showing this one because if you have not checked my video about installation of visual studio code you can go and check that out video it would be in the top at the i button how to install v visual studio code that one right so you can see that video and you can install the vs code so i'm not go getting into that one because it would take a lot of time in this video only so you have to install the video visual studio code so subscribe my channel to see the latest videos of react js you can also check my android development videos and if you like my videos subscribe my channel share it to your friends so my node.js is downloaded so i'm closing my chrome browser right and now i would uh, show you in my folders so here you can see that node 17.2 i have downloaded the 17.2 actually for latest versions so simply double click on this one and it will start preparing your node.js so let me close this one yes so this is coming so simply click on next don't change anything uh, there is option change repair or remove installation so as i have installed my node.js from previously so it is coming like this but in your case if you have not installed it nothing will come simply click on next on this one means in your case you don't have to do anything like this simply click on next next and it will install the whole process now once it is done what you can do is uh, in your local machine search cmd once you have search cmd you can write here node node you can uh, write node slash version and you will see 17.2.0 it is my node version currently so once it is installed successfully you can uh, see that uh, in this one in your screen in cmd that whether it is installed successfully or not right so node.js i think that you have successfully installed by now there is no such big thing simply click on next next click on uh, add path that one so that it will add the path automatically and it will install the thing now to create a react app uh, what you have to do is come any of your folder like where you want to create your react projects like the react js web app so here i have a made a folder known as react js apps to get my react js projects now what i will do is uh, first of all i will open with uh, open this one with my cmd cmd right so it will open my control panel now after that thing to create a react app there is a simple command that is known as npx create react app so let me show you in the official docs uh, so i will uh, it will be easy for you to understand uh, so i will search for react docs here uh, getting started with react right so this is the official one so here you can see uh, 
create a new react app you can go for this one and there is the command for this one npx create my react app right and for that thing i will copy this thing to make you understand that it is a easy process this was our i will pasting this one and instead of my react app i will change this name to test okay so and hit the enter button now once you hit the enter button it will start processing all the things and it will create your react app at the file location that you have selected right so let it process whole process so it is processing the whole thing let us wait and let's just see so you will see that installing react react dom react script now all this now what is react if you many of you don't know what is react react is especially a framework it is especially a web framework so if you want to learn react subscribe my channel i would be posting videos on react js yes so you can see that it is done and uh, installing template dependencies and all so it will take a little bit of more time so yeah it is done all the things are being completed so that is the process of our creating a react app yes it takes a little bit of time but the thing is really efficient now we have to check this one right uh, the code on all the things we have simply created that one so now i will open my vs code in that particular folder this is the folder in my react js app you can see so i will right click on this one and i will click on open with code so in vs code uh, this particular folder will be opened react js app means the app that we created dot test and I, now if you open this folder means if you expand this folder you will see different options are there right src is the main part where all the things are done the code are here you can see this is the javascript code inside that html code is there and all the things are there which are the basic things of react js now to run this app uh, click on terminal and after that click on new terminal here now you can see the folder path here right but to run this one we have to come inside the path that is test means we have to go inside the test folder first of all right so that we can run the test part means the test web app that we have created with react js so for that click on means type cd and then give the folder name that is test so now you can see that it has came under test and now we can write npm start to start our app npm start hit enter and once you hit enter it will start doing the process you can see react script starts so just wait you have successfully installed node.js for react.js framework and it is the process of starting our react app so that we can see that it is successfully running or not so you can see starting deployment and it will open up any of your browser which is the default browser and you will see it is loading and it is the location that is local host right so just wait for a minute it will load all the things and you will see the default page of the react js app and congratulations you have successfully installed and done all the things so you can see that is the react logo and all the things are here learn react you can go and learn this from here also right so i'm not showing the basic things it is done so this is how you can install node.js with vs code for react js and it is done completely so if you have liked this video subscribe my channel share it with your friends and i would see you in the next video of my react js till then bye bye have a great day